You were part of me for a long time We've been together for so long, yeah, yeah Guys, welcome back to our channel. Um, I know it's been a while. It's been about three weeks almost since we posted the video. Our last video is when we had Junior, so you already know what's been basically going on. Um, just, we're getting used to a newborn, man. It's been tough. It has been tough, especially having two babies now. It's been real, real tough, but not impossible. Yeah, guys, I had RJ almost three weeks ago. He's been doing so good. He's already he's already got up to his birth weight. He's been eating really good, using the bathroom so much. He's a little cry baby though, just like his dad was when he was a baby. But he's doing so good. I can't be more happier. Alana, she's doing a lot better. She's actually been off her passy for three days now, so I'm trying to get through that stage. She's been doing real good though. She's still like understanding that she has to be gentle with RJ. She doesn't she doesn't understand that yet. Um, she likes to talk to him. We'll go in there and she'll be like, hey, hey. And he'll be over there just knocked out. So that's good. Um, I've been doing really well. I've already been working out. I've lost, I think. Yeah, I've lost 20 pounds now. I got 10 more pounds to go until I'm back to my birth. My pre-pregnancy weight, not my birth weight, my pre-pregnancy weight. Um, working out, just spending time with hubby. <sighs> Today is the day, guys. Today is the day that I take Ricky to uh, the hotel, which is where he'll spend the night tonight. And then tomorrow, he'll, of course, he'll go to Memphis in the morning. And then he'll go to the airport and ship out to basic training tomorrow. I'm trying my best to, like, hold back the tears, guys. I'm not ready for this at all. It's gonna be, it's gonna be difficult. It is, but you know, we're strong. I'm strong. God has us. God has a plan for everything. This is a part of His plan. I have to trust and believe that everything's gonna be okay, especially with everything going on now. But Ricky ships to basic tomorrow, so I'll be you know, putting in some footage of tomorrow also in this video so y'all can just kind of see how everything goes. Junior's gonna start crying, hold on. Yeah, guys, it's just, I know I'm gonna cry like a baby. I'm gonna miss Ricky so much. So he'll be in uh, South Carolina for basic for two months. Um, and then he'll go to Virginia for about six months for his AIT. So he'll be gone for about, you know, just say six months for AIT. No, it's four months for AIT. He'll be gone six months in total. So it's okay, man. Hey, man. Hey. Hey, stay. Hey, Jacob. Hey, my boogie. Yo. I'm not ready. I'm not ready to take him to the hotel tonight. I'm not ready for that. Um, I'll be at the airport to, you know, to see him off. I'm not ready for that either. I'm having a hard time, guys. I don't know how I'm going to get through this without my best friend. Without my better half. I just gotta stay strong and know that this is all a part of God's plan. <laughs> I'm sorry, hold on. So here's my little man, guys. Ricky Jr. Look just like his daddy. He got a little bit of hair back there, guys. <laughs> he ain't all bald. <laughs> this is my little man, guys. My little stankums. My little stankum foot. A little take a foot and say, hey, RJ. Hey, RJ. Hey, Stanky. Hey, little man. Tell y'all, he's a crybaby. Huh. Look, boo boo. Hey, look, say, hey. Hey. <laughs> 
<laughs> Say hey, Stank. Shy right now, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, guys. Rick will be back in just a second. We're finna eat some food and then spend the rest of the time together today before we have to take him to the hotel. So, um, I'll catch y'all in the next part. Love y'all. Say bye. Alright, so let's try to see who can burp the loudest. Okay. You only get one try now. And the video is gonna determine who's who's louder. Let's leave for basic. Um, he's over at MEPS right now. I'm gonna swear in. I'm really excited for him. This is the last the last step before he'll you know go to the airport and leave for basic training. It's gonna be it's gonna be exciting. It's gonna be adventure, a new chapter. It's gonna be a little difficult of course. But our family has this <sighs> y'all. I'm so proud of him, like you have no idea. Ricky, I'm so, so proud of you, babe. I'm so happy you made this decision to become a United States soldier. To fight for your country and to make things better for our family. I really appreciate you being so mature and so brave to go out and do this through everything that's happening in the world right now. And just know your your family loves you so 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 much and we're gonna support you every step of the way and we'll be here when you get back. We love you, babe. That's it. We love that dad. <laughs> I state your full name. I Ricky Cameron Holmes. Do solemnly swear or affirm. Do solemnly swear or affirm. I will support and defend. And I will support and defend. The Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. Against all enemies. Against all enemies. Foreign and domestic. 
born in New Mexico. That I'll bear true faith. That I'll bear true faith. And allegiance to the same. And allegiance to the same. And that I will obey. And that I will obey. The orders of the President of the United States. The orders of the President of the United States. And the orders of. And the orders of. The officers appointed over me. The officers appointed over me. According to regulation. According to regulation. And the uniform code of military justice. And the uniform code of military justice. So help me God. So help me God. You can lower your right hand. All right, good job, everybody. Now, so right now I'm sitting at the airport um, waiting for Ricky to get here. He just uh, finished swearing in and he got his brief, so he should be uh, leaving there soon to come here. I'm not really sure like what time he's gonna fly out or anything. So I'm not sure how like how long we're gonna get to see each other for. I'm hoping I at least get to see him for 30 minutes. I'm hoping at least that, but of course, the more the better, you know. I'm not ready for this. I'm not prepared to physically see him. You watch him walk away. Like I said, he'll be gone for probably like six months. Man, I don't know why. I'm so sad about this. I'm happy as hell, but I'm sad also because he's literally my best friend, guys. We've been married two and a half years, and we've never spent a whole day without each other. Like, we've been together every day. And then for the past month, I've been on maternity leave, so we spent 24-7 together. I gotta be strong, I gotta be strong for myself, the kids. I gotta be strong for him. I'm ready for this all to be over though. I'm so ready. I'm ready to move past this point. Cause I know it's hard right now because it's happening now, but I know as time goes by, it's gonna get easier. It's gonna be easier to deal with. It's just right now, he's he's leaving today. <laughs> Alright. Let's go see him, guys.